Okay, so it's time to take out this guy with the Brave Sword, but in the process, I will be attacked by um, multiple units. Oh, Nafni, I really need you to pull a miracle here. Can you do this for me? Please say yes, and I promise I will love you forever. I'll make you one of my mains in my uh, Radiant Dawn Let's Play. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> okay, so I can also put Kieran here with the... No, here. With the Iron Lance. Just because with this guy... Ugh, do I really want to be... Uh, to be reckless? The answer is easily no. Okay, so what I will have my yellow units do this turn is actually head out for this point. That way, I'll be... I'll be damn sure that my units will be fine. Oh, I almost forgot about you. Uh, Brave Lance, next stabber, next stabber. One damage is not gonna do all that much anyway. And he also cancelled it, so all for the better. Okay, so for now I will send Oscar in the direction of these wyverns. Even if this guy has an axe and this guy, this guy has a short spear. I don't think it will be an issue. Oscar will be able to take care of all of them by himself. Of that, I have no doubt. Um, uh, men staff, physics staff. Now, I can use the men this time. Physics are more valuable after all. Really don't want to risk it, you know. Meanwhile, my army moves towards the edge of the castle. I know there are probably going to be reinforcements coming to bite me in the in in the butt, but let's face it, it's something that does have to happen now and again, doesn't it? Okay, so uh, Raisin, you can chant for Mist here, just in case she can actually heal someone, because unlike Alicia, she actually has range. I'm not sure if she or Alicia would be a better candidate for the Ashera staff. We'll see, I suppose. Let's see, a uh, one, two, three, four. I'll do it next turn, but just in case. Uh, you take the silver sword that you cannot use. And then move out. You can move here. Alright, so um, this way... Nefni will get attacked by a lot of units, but I am confident she can actually make it. Like, I believe. She can also dodge, you know. Okay, so the yellow units go in the... Um, outside of the range of the enemies. That works for me. Okay, Nefni, this is the trial by fire, I suppose. Ow, that actually dealt more damage than I thought it would. Okay, defense here would be nice. Ah, Nafni. I really want to love you. Oh, wait, that's the sleep... That's a sleep staff. That needs to die. Okay, so more units are headed my way now. Ouch. Oh, Kieran was in range of this guy. All for the better. One less unit off of uh, Nafni's back. Okay, so I think now I actually have a chance. There is hope. And apparently this is what my hope looks like. <sighs> Cluster of enemies. My favorite. Yeah, Oscar just laughs in the, at, in the face of your weapons. <laughs> He's so good. He's so good and broken. It's not even a joke at this point. And I do love him for that. The fact that he's a super strength and defense blast definitely helps out in the long run. HP and skill speed. Alright. More speed, that's more than nice. That's why you have the Night Ward, my friend. And Rayson finally transforms so I can use my units to their full effect. Uh, no, I actually want Mist here. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use the Hamurn Staff on the Sonic Sword right now. 
I know I could have attacked another time, but do you really want to take the risk? Personally, I don't. Skill speed. Is speed cap too? And she got S rank. Alright. Yep, speed is also capped. That's another good news for uh, Radiant Dawn Mist. That's for sure. Okay, so I need to take care of so many of them, it's not even funny. Ugh. Ugh. Poor Alinsha. You try, I know you do. And I'll make sure you will try harder in the next game. Let's put the killer bow to use again. The best use. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Wolf. I really appreciate what you do for me. You know, if you actually manage to cap out some stats, I think in Radiant Dawn you can actually be useful. And I think you are one point away from capping speed and two from skill. That works. Okay, so I think I can start sending Jill up here to meet some of the remaining paladins. Let's see, Silver Sword, Steel Bow, Laguz Axe. This seems to have a short axe as well. I don't need to worry about the bow. Full guard! And even then, that would have dealt like a 7 damage or something, so... Not really all that threatening, are you? Okay, I do need to kill this guy with the steel bow now. No, uh, no counterattack? Perfect. Giving guard to Oscar was probably one of the best things I could do. Okay, uh, Soren, I'll leave you in charge of taking down the sniper here. That's overkill, buddy. <laughs> That's overkill by all accounts. Okay, it's 1 p.m., so... I'm getting hungry. And when I get hungry, it's not really all that good. Okay, I do need to dance for my units effectively, so... One burn sword master coming up. I do want to dance for mist so that uh Okay, I think I will need to pull back Nephew or Healer at the very least. Okay, so now Mist has um S rank stage, so she could use the Ashira staff if I ever so wanted to. But the question here is do I really need her? to be the, um, the what you call it, the Ashira staff user, because uh, I was considering it, but I changed my mind almost instantly. You on the other hand would be a better choice. Yep, definitely. And this is why I love Janaf. So awesome. Okay then, now what's next? Uh, five paladins to take down. I think I have the units to do this. Uh, and I also have the poleaxe, but I don't double, so I will have to rely on a crit to kill with Largo. Uh, anyone who is low down by anything? Uh, steel blade by one. And that's it. So Largo will not be able to double, like, ever. Or maybe even the majority of my units won't be able to do anything here. But... If I move myself properly, I mean, I can use Ike now. Safely. Dead. One less short axe to worry about. I do need to uh, kill the one with the bow. We all know I have to. Then I'll do... I think I'll have to use the Brave Bow here. Yep, it's kinda mandatory. Sure, a crit here would help, but... Hey, I take what I can get. Astrid is pretty good already, so... I mean, her defenses could be better. But her growths in those stats aren't really all that fantastic, if I remember. Skill. Not sure if skill is capped. I think the cap is 27. No, it's 26. So okay, skill is Peter capped. 
If you could, if only you could cap strength, but you would need to get a perfect level up, like five out of five level ups. That would, that is not going to be easy. Okay, so let's put the Brave Axe to good use. And Soul Crusher. It's, it's actually kind of refreshing that unlike Radiant Dawn, where all mastery skills have like triple damage or any kind of gimmick like that. In this game, they actually stick to what they say in the description. So, uh, basically, if it says... If it, if it does say, um... The only thing it does, the only thing Soul does is heal up. You only heal up. That's, um, that's very good, really. Okay, so I will use Marsha to kill this one. Then I can actually dance for a mist. I can dance for mist. Uh, okay, good enough. Good job, Marsha. I can dance for Marsha, Mist, Alincia, and Astrid. That works for me. Na 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 na. Okay, so um, I have another one here to kill. And I think, I think I would like to give the kill to someone that I would actually use, like Mist. So, Big Brother, give me my sword back. It definitely works. And now Mist can wreck shop more than ever. <laughs> okay, so ideally... Okay, I have someone in range of this guy already, so... Chances are that guy with the short axe and the goose axe here will probably go for um, Kieran or Leth, as they have no range of retaliation. Uh, this guy will go for Janaf, and he has a Laguz Lance, I just saw that. How much damage will he deal? A uh, 44 attack, 15 defense... Janaf will survive, but that's gonna hurt like hell. Oh, Soren is in range. Hold on. Need to take him off here. Immediately. So, actually, wait. Let me highlight this guy. So, here's what I'm going to do. Going to... No, not don't want to rescue. I want to take. Wait. Take... And drop. Put Marsha here. Ronald here. No. Stay put. You stay here. And maybe uh, this guy will go for Har because weapon uh, advantage. And Bastion, you can go here. You can blast anyone. Okay, so as long as the four Pegasus stay out of... That's gonna hurt. <sighs> Alright, he dodged. That's all for the better, I suppose. I think Mist will have some fun with that general. Actually, I'm pretty confident that's exactly what is going to happen. I don't remember if there is a conversation between Bertra... Oh, snap. Oof. I forgot that guy had a bow. Janaf could have easily be dead now. And of course, that reinforcements have to spawn. Two of them with siege tones, like, thank you, game. Okay, I I think Bertram is stationary. This guy isn't. So, you know what's actually gonna happen? More blasting is in order. Yeah, Rip Bolting, you served me quite well. In all fairness, if you don't use Siege Tomes when you have the chance, when are you ever going to use them? Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, I'm sorry, I actually had to um, make a shortcut. I, ha I actually had to check something on my computer, as well as actually ordering a takeout for lunch, because I actually got... I'm actually pretty hungry. And I can't wait. 
Okay, so I have to deal with these uh, pesky reinforcements that spawn it out of nowhere. And there's no better time than now. Okay, so I know for a fact that I will need a Jill and Hard to take care of, um, you know, the majority of them anyway. Oh, or rather, Kieran can take care of the Thoron Mage, which is what I would really want. Alright. Then what I would want to, if it's at all possible, but I'm not really sure now. Oh, yes it is! Yes it is! Holy freaking crap! It is! <laughs> but the question is, can Har actually kill this guy? Easily. My strategy would have seriously gone to hell if, um, if I couldn't kill that Sage. And, sure, get a level up, why don't you? HP, Strength, Skill, Defense. Yeah, those are the stats where um, Har actually has the better growths, I think. Again, I don't remember them... Uh, ...right now. Also, I think it would be a good idea to send someone up there and help Janaf. What, don't you say? I would put Jill in range of this guy. I would really, really love to... ...but... I do want to give the kill to Ike. He's the one that, I, that is actually in need of that the most. And next turn, he will go and play with Bertram. Ike actually got some experience in this map. Although Mist is certainly behind her, behind him. And much like I thought, Mist actually loves to play with her newly and newly renewed Sonic Sword. But now leaves the question, who's taking care of that that guy up there? Answer. <laughs> this actually stops being funny after a while, you know? Flamelands, yeah. Mist will be able to take care of this guy, well, I will send Ike to start taking uh, attacks on Bertram right there. Could, it could have danced better, but you know what? You take what you can get, right? Uh, Sora, and you start moving out towards Bertram because... Okay, so I will send Oscar and Alinsha to help out. Because, um... Let's face it. Uh, Oscar does give that sweet Earth affinity to Ike making the battle against Bertram even easier than what it should be. And I do want it to be easier. Alright. This seems to be working. Yeah, one hit is all I need, but my girl. Don't tell me. Okay. I was getting scared for the moment. Alright, that works for me. And... Uh, okay, no mess, you stay here. I don't want to risk it. So, positioning Oscar here is good. Hmm... I actually think I'll keep the Silver Sword. The reason why he actually deals so much damage is because the rune sword he has equipped is a magic-based sword. Essentially, it's a sword with the Nosferatu built in. It's actually pretty powerful. And he has Daunt, which decreases a hit and critical of my units within three spaces. Then again, my chances aren't too evil here, but I think I'll keep the silver sword. Yep. Do or die. Perish. Perish. So you're Bertram, are you? Sorry, but I can't perish right now. Me. Kill. What? Kill me. Kill me. What's going on? Are you mad? 
Come on, I actually need to proc Ether here. Uh. Well, I will be able to milk a lot of experience out of that guy, that's for sure. With Alinsha's help, he can stay topped off for quite a long time. And the first level of Alinsha, let's see. Strength, magic, skill, spe speed, luck. Perfect offensive level up. And the more magic she can get, the better. So... Also... I wonder... One, two, three... No. That wouldn't be... Um, that wouldn't be such a nice idea. Like, my idea was simply doing it like a shove chain in order to bring Soren closer to Ike. But I don't think I have enough unit to do that. Yeah, I am one unit short. Like, seriously. Or maybe not. Oh, maybe yes. Never mind. I have my plan. Shove. Take a look at this beautiful next-gen strat. Yeah, next-gen strat, ladies and gentlemen. Next gen, and now Ike has full advantage of his 42 extra avoid. <laughs> Come kill me now, Bertram. I dare you. Okay, so I think there will be more reinforcements coming in, but now that I'm close to the castle, I'm not going anywhere. I'll direct the yellow units in case I need that. Problem with Bertram is that he can... Oh, he uses the spear now because of weapon triangle advantage. Ether, I won. Of course not. Well, I could give the kill to someone else then. HP magic defense. Alright, Ike. You're so close to capping some stats and yet you're not? Ah. <sighs> well, you capped strength, skill, and defense now. Okay, okay, okay. I do need to cap speed. I think it's one point away. Man, Ike in uh, Radiant Dawn will be so broken it's not even funny. And I suppose? No, actually, wait. One can try. Yeah, perish, perish. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Bye! Oh, okay, Mist has to run away now. Yeah. Uh, release. Yeah, he longed for that, it seemed. And missed get a level, another level up. Nice. HP, strength, luck, resistance. I think some other stat is close to cap at this point. And I get the rune sword with a lot of uses left. So that's more than nice. Okay, magic and speed are capped, like I said. And I think resistance is the next one. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so I'll actually... No, you know what? Let's seize and get this over with. Sir, the enemy troops are fle fleeing. Shall we give chase? Dude, are you stupid? No. No, let them run. We fought enough today. Get our men inside the fort and give everyone a break. Yes, sir. Alright, that was a battle. It actually went easier than I thought. Alright. I see. So Crimea won another victory, have they? <laughs> well then, send the rest of our troops to Castle Nados as reinforcements. Put General Hafed in charge and let him exchange blows with them. Yet, that would leave the capital unprotected by only the Imperial Guard. You forget yourself, Knight. I will be here as well. If they defeat Hafed and make it all the way here, then they make then they are a worthy to cross swords with me. I would beg a question, your highness. Why do you divide our troops and give the enemy the advantage? It's as if you were... As if I were? What? Go on. It's as if you desire the Crimean army to continue winning and making its way here to you. I'll not deny it. Are you saying 
that you desire Dane's defeat? No, I am not. If you think through it clearly, Dane will not lose. We had many plans we when we started this war. We went through many scenarios, many predictions. But as you know, our predictions have been completely overturned by this gang of rabble. Was that luck? Or was it the gap in skill between the individual soldiers? And if it is, aren't you interested in see how far they can come? I, I do not understand. <laughs> Perfect. Nothing raises my spirit like war. Come, Crimea, let me be the one to consume your noble hearts. What are you, a heartless from Kingdom Hearts? Ugh. Okay, we cleared chapter 26. That was one hell of a ride, not gonna lie. I thank you for joining me. If you enjoyed, please leave, leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Click on the bell, the usual stuff. Name is Bimbahama Raven, and I will see you soon. Peace out.